Well, hello folks. It's been a while since I've done anything and that's a shame because things have been going on here. Gonna go out to the shed right now, the barn as I call it. We've got four new chickens. Even though we did get rid of them, we bought four new chicks. I think they're all Easter egg layers. So let's go take a look at them. All right. Well, if you've been on my channel for a while or our channel, I should say, Gene and I's, is my nasty shed used to have all the quail in it and this is where i was raising all of the chickens again if you've been in here a while you would recognize it nest boxes were over there what i've done is i built a temporary brooder in here got a little heat and we've got four chickens and i just want to show you what i built just scrap osb that i had around the house and uh this will turn into their home I've already got the, uh, what do you call it, the roost area, the door back there that I had installed before. So everything is still here that was here. And this is what we've got in here now. There's one, uh, we got these from Myers Hatchery. The three of them, they're not all Easter Eggers. I think there's one Easter Egger and two Americanas. And then the one little one in the back there she is some kind of, she was free, and uh, she's not anything particular, but it is a female, supposedly, and they will lay eggs. It's chilly out here, so this one here always looks a little down. I don't know if it's got an attitude or what. Other than, other than looking down, it seems to be pretty healthy. But I got water, they're getting, uh, extra nutrients in the water and I've got an organic starter feed for them right now. All that down there is not chicken mess, it's just um, feed that they continuously scratch out. But anyway, just wanted you to see what was going on and uh, they're doing fine. They're about two weeks old now and I'll update you as they get a little bigger. Just to show you outside the garden real quick. Uh, it's emptied and we will be starting in another couple of months, uh, putting it all back together. Got some new plans coming, what we're gonna do this year. Had a lot of success with the pollinator garden. So we're very excited to get started next year. 